Dip and Squish Coasters coming up next. So I had been working on another project, as you can see by the mess on the table, and the colors were so beautiful, I just decided I had to use them up. And uh, that's why I decided to do the dip and squish method um, of uh, dipping the coasters in and squishing them around uh, to get these fabulous, fabulous patterns. And, um, and then because I didn't have that much, I used up some of that leftover paint right on the surface there and uh, kept adding and dipping and squishing. So I use uh, puppy pads because they are super absorbent and they work so well, especially for this kind of method. Uh, I never have anything leaking through, uh, none of the paint goes through. So it's a great way to be able to work on a surface and not worry about it. This is just such a fun and easy technique that really anybody can do. Uh, you just have to get the consistency right. I've even done it in the past with just paint and water. You don't want it to be too runny and you don't want it to be too thick. Now when I dip the coasters, I do try and uh, put the paint on the outside of the, the edges so that gets covered and I'm not too worried about the back because they get covered in cork. Okay, here they are. Wow, just leftover paint. Look how beautiful. I love it. Really beautiful. I love this dip and squish. It is easy and fun and anyone can do it. Just get the right consistency of paint. And look at that. Look at the cells there, just a little bit of cells forming. Look at the color variations, because the red and purple, the red and blue will make purple. And so you'll have those combining. The gold is popping through, more prominent here. And I love that they are a set, but very different each one is unique love it i'll show you back here in one second when uh, they're dry okay so it's been 24 hours and they and here they are all dried up and i think they look fabulous each one is beautiful loving the colors and the gold is really coming through look at that beautiful bit of uh, cell action there Really lovely, I'm going to varnish them. And I varnish them with this. It's Krylon Crystal Clear. It's permanent, non-yellowing, moisture resistant, and dries in minutes. So um, that shines it all up, and then I put a cork backing on it, and they're ready to go. Click on the link you see now to see how I finish my coasters. Join my Facebook group called Soraya Silvestri Artist Amazing Abstracts, Semi-Abstracts and Pores. The link is in the description area below.